what is up guys how is everybody doing i am tip welcome back to my channel y'all i have been sick i said in that last reading that that pollen was killing my energy bro like it was just i could not talk i was raspy i sounded like uh our, my voice is already annoying but i sounded like a chick that had been in a bar for 20 years smoking cigarette after cigarette i was like hell no i can't put out these this video so i just kind of just ate drank tea ate cough drops did what i could y'all but i'm sorry i don't want y'all to feel like i forgot about y'all because that's all that's been weighing heavily on me is getting my content out i know people rely on me i am sorry i love you guys i miss you guys let's see what's going on within your connection at this time if you would like a personal all that information's in the description box below there's an energy here of somebody that has some other priorities going on in their life okay um there could be another relationship job kids whatever it is and there's somebody that it's almost trying to control timing in a way of trying to make you wait okay um the card does say trying to control timing has other priorities so it's like this person expects somebody to wait around for them to get their shit together um and to put it's almost like this person is putting other things before not making this a priority if that makes sense okay it's almost like they want you to wait around and control time and oh let me get this together give me more time give me more time let me do this let me do that but yet while they're doing this they're not prioritizing you or this connection at all this is on the very last on their list type energy or that's how somebody is feeling right because they do have other priorities and other obligations this person is really trying to make time okay um or wait something out but it's almost like spirit has told this person like this is expired it's done okay but they're still focusing on these other priorities let's see yeah, no real urgency, lack of care or effort. So there's this energy from somebody where it's like this person, and look at how she, okay, what's interesting is there's this masculine energy on this card. He's pinching his little beard, and he's looking over this way, and she is just kind of sitting back in her chair, waiting, looking over at him like, wow. So there's this energy where I'm telling you somebody is really feeling like they're not a priority in whoever they're dealing with life and it's whether you know whatever they have going on somebody is just feeling like they're not a priority and it's starting to hurt and it's because this other person they're not showing no effort no care no real urgency when it comes to this okay there's also this energy of somebody one of you is too toxic healing work needs to be done and i feel like that goes for whoever you're dealing with the person that is not being prioritized is starting to see that maybe this person is just toxic as fuck you know they're acting like they just don't care they don't show no effort they don't show no care you know and it could be because of what else they got going on, but it's almost like whoever this energy here who's feeling like they're on the back burner or like they're unheard or their feelings and emotions are being met are starting to see, well, maybe, or starting to think, well, maybe this person is just too toxic, man. This person needs to heal. They still got some shit that they got to work on because somebody here is not being loved correctly and not being prioritized uh in a way that they should i feel like somebody is being very emotionally neglected here okay um yeah wanting to be left alone indulging in too much seclusion and what's interesting is normally i would feel like that would be the other person but i feel like because of how this person is acting or treated you there could be this energy of feeling like you know they're too toxic and now you just want to be left alone you know just whatever it is like where your emotional needs aren't being met there's this energy of you know what i just want to fucking get in my bed watch tv up under the ac and not be bothered by nobody like damn like you know this person is 
the person that I'm prioritizing putting first is putting me damn near last or is just acting like my feelings and my emotions doesn't matter. So there all, there's also this energy of somebody that's just kind of breaking down or just kind of pulling back. Now this could be them though, okay? It could be them that, you know, they're the ones that just acting like they want to be left alone spending time alone but I feel like it's you you know like you're spending a lot of time alone they're not putting any of your needs or emotions on their priority list and so that in turn hurts and makes somebody seclude themselves even more this card says you want things your way they fear losing their freedom so there, you know, so it could be, it doesn't even have to be in a relationship that they prioritize. This could be their own life, them going out, them doing this, them doing that. This person, it's like they don't want to completely give into this situation because they feel like there's this sense of freedom that they would lose. But it's like, you're like, hell no, you got me fucked up. Like, you want things your way, and I don't think it's bad. I don't think, think it's, like, controlling. I feel like it's like, damn, no, you need to be be at the, you know, be here with me. You know, you're the one that's sitting here in seclusion all the time, alone, you know, feeling like, damn, this person doesn't even, like, isn't even hearing me out. They're not prioritizing me, you know, and damn, that's all I want is to be a priority in this person's life. And yeah, of course you want that your way. But it's like they're not giving you that or giving into that because they don't want to lose this sense of freedom that they have. And it's beginning to hurt because it's like, okay, do you not enjoy spending time with me? Are you having fun? Are you better off out there with everybody else that you're having fun with? Like, is it something about me? That starts to cave in on somebody and I feel like that's where somebody you guys are wanting to be left alone kind of just like gosh damn like somebody's emotional somebody doesn't want to be emotional but they're emotional because of this so because they're emotional it's like they just want to spend time alone they're already feel like they're spending a lot of time alone because this other person isn't putting out no lack of care no effort no urgency no empathy for you know no emotional support physical support you know What else is going on within this connection at this time, Spirit? Mm -hmm. Wow, that's interesting. That's so fucking interesting. So there could be some kind of ending, okay? Where this person wasn't willing to lose, you know, because there's this energy of somebody being like, you know what, this person's just too toxic. They're not meeting my emotional or physical needs. They're not putting me as a priority. I just want to be left the fuck alone, maybe distance myself. But I feel like there's a, with the death card and the six of cups, there's that energy of an ending. But that ending brings a beautiful new beginning, right? A transformation and a change within somebody. So it's like, it's almost like, as you pull away from this person, this person is going to realize that they should have prioritized you from the beginning, okay? And I feel like that's going to bring some transformation and some change within this person and lead to a beautiful new beginning with that Six of Cups. That's a card of reconciliation, being heavily on somebody's mind, heavily in somebody's thoughts. Damn near can't get you off of their mind and just daydreaming about coming back together the good times you know wanting to to bring this shit back together reminiscing and so i feel like through that ending or that pulling back of an energy there's going to be a change where this person can't get you off their mind they're realizing how important you are in their life and it brings this transformation and then this new beginning Oh, I've seen the lovers. What else is going on here, spirit? What else is going on here, spirit? Shit, they just bounce. The Empress and the Five of Wands. Mm. So this other energy, and I'm just going to be quite honest, okay? 
there could be like another energy another the priority could be like maybe they have a child with somebody maybe like a baby mom or something who's very very jealous i'm seeing this in two ways so y'all bear with me on both of these okay there's this energy of this maybe baby mom or this other person okay who's very very jealous of the relationship you guys have feel like they're in competition there's jealousy there could be a lot of fighting and arguing between whether it be your person and this this you know mother of their child father of their child or you know between you and them there's definitely a stir where whoever this is tries to create a lot of chaos a lot of problems but the thing is whoever this person is and this is the other part it's like you're coming up as this empress energy this unfuckwithable energy this unbothered all four queens empress gorgeous beautiful energy right and people are so motherfucking jealous of that they try to compete with this empress the five of ones are trying to compete with this empress jealous as hell probably starting little petty ass arguments fights whatever it is but y'all can't compete y'all can't compete with the empress and so you see how this is looking you see all these people that are trying to compete and start fights and look at how this empress is turned away look at where she's turned looking let me fix my lighting so you guys can see that properly look she's looking away i'm motherfucking bothered with this look on her face like hm, i'm gonna let them peasants be okay so that could be what that other priority or whatever that is in this person's life people are jealous as fuck and it's just your energy period this could be somebody that your person has kids with okay um that definitely try to cause issues in the in your life there is an energy of this person taking forever unless there's some changes made here you know continuing to take their time or move very very slowly oh shit yeah the hanged man yeah there's definitely gonna be this person mm, taking their time ten of cups in reverse yeah, so it could be like some kind of family situation that they're not happy in that's taking a while. Very uncomfortable situation that somebody is trying to like slowly but surely get their way out of. Um, damn, I hit, I hit my thing when I did that. Definitely some kind of situation maybe, you know, that they're waiting to blow over. There could be some threats of somebody like, you know, not being able to see their child here also. If, if, because I'm feeling an energy of maybe you getting into this, into it with this person. If, if this is that energy, if you resonate with that, maybe getting in, in getting into it with this other person. And now they're like, nah, I don't like that bitch. You know, you can't bring my child around her because we done got that type of energy. But it's just like a control factor a controlling energy that really just feels like they're in competition and very jealous of this unbothered empress who ain't even stunting stunting them right um i don't feel like there's i feel like that's where the uncomfortable situation and this timing factor comes in because i feel like ultimately this person is in love with you they want to be with you they think about how happy the two of you guys could be together the future that you guys could have together but then there's this energy where they've been put into a very uncomfortable situation because this other energy threatens them like i don't like that i'm telling you i don't like that bitch uh you know try to down talk you y'all got into it whatever it is and i don't want my child around her and it's literally manipulation it's a way to try to control and manipulate your person and that fucks with your person especially if you're resonating with this and they got a child here because they love that child you know they don't want to be put out over some bitter ass baby mama because the dad's moving forward and happy now supposedly he don't love his child because of that no this person very much loves their child and this is where that resentment and that knight of pentacles that slow moving energy that energy of trying to control timing comes in because this person does not want whoever this bitter ass person is to completely cut them out of this child's life 
um, and then say, oh, you know, but you chose that that other person over your child. Very childish. Whatever this person's going through, it's very, it's very fucked up. But they put themselves in this situation. They did this to themselves. Um, and, but it's like, now they're, they're, it's almost like they're not prioritizing you, so there's a time where you're gonna pull back your energy, and they're really gonna re realize what they're missing here. At the end of the day, can't nothing keep you from your child if you're doing what you're supposed to do, and that's why we need to start being smart and educating ourselves and, you know, going to the courts and seeing what we can do, especially when you're dealing with that type of energy, so... Definitely feel like there's an energy of you pulling back because you're not being put as a priority. But I don't feel like it's you. I feel like they're being very controlled through a child. Like, I don't want my child around that bitch. Or, like, if they have to go to baby this person's house to see the child and you're like, what the fuck? You, why you gotta go over there to spend time with your child and it's making you uncomfortable? That's what's going on here. And I feel like that could be another thing where you feel like you're not a priority because that makes you feel uncomfortable. Like, why you got to go over to her house to hang out with the kid? Of course, we're going to first off be like, no, nah, y'all. But it's not that. It's that sh whoever this other energy is bitter in the only way, like, is really trying to control the situation. So they're just trying to die that down so that they can get time with their child. I'm just being honest, okay? All right, that's what I have for you guys. If that resonates at all, comment below. Let me know. Until next time, loves. Peace.